Vancouver side. I'm Jim Maines. This is Gary Bach, and you're watching the video blog of everything north of the Columbia River. Today we're checking out the Sausage Fest. That's right, this annual event that's held the uh, weekend after Labor Day right here at St. Joseph's Catholic Church is a Vancouver tradition. You and we're it. on a mission today, Jim. We're on a mission? Oh yeah, we're gonna track down this character right here. Sir link a -lot? Sir link a -lot. That is our task for the day, is to find Sir link a -lot and get a great interview. All right, we're gonna go find Sir. Are you ready, Gary? Ready. Let's go. Oh! Say that again. There <laughs> So, Vancouver doesn't have a first lady, but apparently we have a first sausage. And Mayor Tim Levitt is going to throw it. He's going to toss it out a little bit later on. We're looking forward to that. Don't think we're not. He's tossing the sausage. The first sausage. Tossing the first sausage. He's the first sausage. He's tossing the first sausage. This is not your downstream sausage. I've been working out. I can throw it really far. Okay. It's got to go far. Because I'm going to throw it way up there. One. Two. <laughs> okay, we have a little prize here for the uh, the young lady that caught the ceremonial sausage. What's your name? Anna. Anna, and how old are you? Ten. So Anna gets the lollipop and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight ride tickets. How do you like that? That's, that sounds good, she said. Checked it out. There's all kinds of great things around here. There's purses and ties and clothes. It's there's, wonderful. There's ministries. There's food. There's nonprofits. But there's Sir Links a lot. Sir there Links. Are. There he is. Come on. God is the blessing, I'm, sure. I'm Judy McMorrin. I am the development director here at St. Joseph Catholic School. And welcome to Sausage Fest 2012. Sausage Fest has been around for a long time. This is our 41st year. I'm told that means 40th anniversary. And back in 1972. It began because their seventh and eighth grade was at risk of not being at the school anymore because the school was running low on money. And the pastor here at St. Joe's had a great idea, he got together a bunch of parishioners, and someone came up with the idea of let's have a festival, a fall festival. So they hauled in a chicken wagon, people brought in their corn, their potatoes, things from their garden, and they held the festival of all festivals, and that started the Vancouver Sausage Fest. So we've been here doing this every single year it takes about 800 people 800 to 900 volunteers every year we start as soon as this one's done we start all over again always the first weekend after labor day we have about 1500 volunteer shifts so that means people who are here in the saint joseph parish volunteers who volunteered from the community for years and years all the school families kick in and we have a great party to kick off the um, fall and fall festival so that's a little bit of background and history about Sausage Fest. As you'll see, when you come and visit us, we have expanded beyond that chicken cart of days gone by. Oh, the good news is that 7th and 8th grade did graduate. And when you come to Fest or you come and visit St. Joseph Catholic School, you can see all the pictures of all the graduates from 1954 in our halls. It's kind of one of those iconic things that people come back to year after year, which is one of the big reasons people come to Sausage Fest. It's the reunion of all reunions for Southwest Washington. He's putting it red pepper. Not bad. It's not bad. I'm telling you right now. Check out the garden bucket. Marigolds on the top. Tomatoes on the bottom. Nice. Hey, can I have a tomato? Yes. All right. This one looks ripe right here. That's a good tomato right there. Great idea. One thing about the Vancouver Sausage Fest is they've got a wide variety of foods, even more than sausages. They've got hamburgers, corn on the cob, ribs, chicken, you name it. And Jim, the best thing they've got is right here. You better believe it. Elephant ears are always the thing to get at the sausage Gary, fest. Sir Links a lot just walked by. Sir Links a lot? We what? gotta go find him. We gotta go find Links a lot. Let's go. go. 
I love sausage. This is a great sausage fest. It's the best in the country. You get the best sausage here, and everyone should come down and enjoy the St. Joseph Sausage Fest. It's great for Vancouver. My name is Matt Tierfelder, and I work for the Vancouver Fire Department, and uh, there's a lot of reasons why I love Vancouver. There's a big national park close to my house. There's everything you want in Vancouver. Jim, they have all the greatest games and carnival rides around here. I mean, it's amazing. They got the Whirly Gig, they got the Merry-Go-Round, and they've got all kinds of great games. It's awesome. They truly use every inch of St. Joseph's Catholic School property. Come on down the weekend after Labor Day. It's going to... Wait, Gary, it's Sir Lynx a lot. Sir Lynx a lot. Come on, we, we found, found him. We found him. Oh, this is fabulous. Sir, how are you doing? Hey, we wanted to interview you all day. We're so glad. What? You can't? Of course oh. not. I got a favor Sir. to ask, Sir Lynx a lot. I would just love to get your autograph oh, on your picture. Awesome. There we go. You know, Gary, now we can officially have a Vancouver side Hall of Fame. I love it. Thanks, sir. Thanks, sir. Take care. We'll see you next time on the Vancouver side. He's the mayor? I didn't know that. He's the mayor of Clark County. Is there a mayor of Clark County? I, I don't know. There might be. Is there a mayor of Clark County? So he's not just the mayor of St. Joe's? It's great for Vancouver. See that? All right. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> How you guys doing? Good?